Royal Diamond back again with another video, guys. Today we are reacting to SML movie Cody's Challenge. Let's get into it, guys. So, guys, what do you want to do today? Dude, 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 we got to do the one chip challenge. The what? The one chip challenge. There's this one chip that's super hot, but once you eat it, you're going to spit it back up. It's so intense. You might cry, you might sweat, or even throw up, dude. It's that hot? Bro, it's that hot. We should all try it. Oh, I got three of them. We're going to try them today. Well, Cody, are you going to try it? Guys, it's a potato chip. It's not that hot. Well, I want to see you try How it. How hot can it be? Then. Okay, let's see what the pamphlet says. It says if you can last one minute, you're powerless. Ten minutes, you're powerful. Thirty minutes, you're supercharged. In one hour, you're invincible. Dude, you're not gonna last ten seconds. Guys, this is a kid's game. I'm a man. I can handle a potato chip. Then eat it, Cody. Yeah. Okay, uh, fine, I will. Let's take a look at this stupid thing. It doesn't look that hot. Ow. It, is it hot, Cody? Mm-mm. Wait, wait, it's not hot at all? Mm-mm. No way. Maybe it's expired. Yeah, it gotta be expired. You're not even chewing it. Come on, I want to try it. I want to try it. I'm gonna open this one up, dude. Yeah, if it's not that hot, I want to try it. Yeah, hold Are on. you sure it's not hot, Cody? No, it's not hot at all. Wait, Cody, why is your face red? Because it's hot. He's trying not to say nothing. Red. <laughs> oh, I, I'm just embarrassed for the chip company because they think it's hot, but it's not. Dude, you're shirtless. Yeah, I, I just want to show you how strong I am and how weak that chip is. He Wait, hot. So the chip wasn't hot at all? No, that chip's for bitches. So you can eat two of them, huh? I could, but I'm not hungry right now. Oh, eat two, eat two. That'd yeah, be so more, dude. You can do it. Yeah, might as well. Yeah, yeah, do it, dude. Mm -mm. Is it hot? Mm -mm. Come on, it has to be hot. It's the one chip challenge. You ate two. Mm -hmm. So Cody's truly a man. He's not a man. He can't be. Oh, you know what would know, be really cool? What? If he could eat three. Dude, he would be a savage. Oh, open it up, open it up. Let's try to eat three. Open it up. Oh, my God. Why won't they eat one? Okay. Uh, Cody, are you... Cody! What? What? Dude! What happened to your hair? Oh, I, I shaved it to show you how much of a badass I am. It, it didn't fall off or anything. Oh, oh, wait, 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 why are you... His eyes bloodshot red. <laughs> eyes red oh i'm just so mad that that chip wasn't as hot as i wanted it to be oh can you eat three because if you could eat three you're truly a badass yeah dude yeah okay i can do this all day yeah. Yeah. go ahead dude i want to see it what, why is your tongue black oh uh, i guess my tongue died because of how hot the chip wasn't oh, 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 eat it then dude because <laughs> of how hot the chip wasn't <laughs> oh, savage 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 Whoa! Dang, dude, you really ate three chips? Wow, you uh, finally ended up in a hospital. That bad. My respect now, bro. Well, oh. boys, your friend Cody's lucky to be alive, but I gotta ask, what happened? Did he try to eat like a thousand bees? No, he ate three of the one chip challenges. What, three? What is he crazy? No, he's a savage. He's well, only supposed to eat one, what? and even then, that one is dangerous. And he ate three like it was nothing. What a badass. So, like, is he gonna die? Well, see, that's the thing. He has third degree burns all over his body, his tongue is medically dead, and his stomach melted. His stomach melted? Yeah, so we're gonna have to do. His stomach melted? <laughs> what? Do a stomach transplant. We'll go in the back and get a stomach. Well, this isn't Best Buy. I don't just have a closet full of stomachs back there. We're gonna need a stomach donor. We'll find a stomach donor. Well, see, that's the problem with stomachs. See, people need stomachs to live. So if we take a stomach from one person, they're gonna need a stomach, and then we're gonna have to take another stomach from someone else for them, and then it just goes on and on with people trading stomachs. So how are we gonna find a stomach? Well, we're gonna have to wait till we find somebody who's dead or dying and take their stomach. Well, why don't we just go to a nursing home and grab an old person and take their stomach? Well, then he'd have the stomach of like an 80 year old man, and then he would only be able to eat like Jello and tapioca. And stuff. So he needs a stomach from someone our age? Yeah, and that's pretty tough because people your age don't usually die unless it's an act. That's that. Okay, that that uh hot chip challenge. It it won't really do that to you. I, mean, I feel like it'll burn your mouth to death, but other than that, nah. Accident. Wait a minute. So what if one of our friends that we don't really care about just so happens to die today? We can bring them to you and you'll take their stomach? Um, if- He said one of your friends that they don't care about, dang, you just gonna be like, hey, I don't really care about you. Let's, let's give your stomach up. <laughs> if somebody your age were to just happen to die, I could use their stomach, yes. Joseph, what's up? We should totally kill one of our friends we don't care about and bring him to buy so we get the stomach. Oh, dude, I've been waiting on this. Let's do it. Yeah, we're going to do that. Uh, okay, I, I didn't hear any of that. Okay, so we're going to bring you a stomach of someone our age. Wait, wait, wait. Just bring me the body and I will handle the stomach. All right, come on, Joseph. Let's go kill someone. Yeah, let's kill our friend. I didn't hear that either. All right, Joseph. Let's name off some friends that we really... They over here talking about, let's kill some friends. Like, they're happy to kill somebody for, for Cody. They don't care about. Ooh, I can name a few. Like Patrick, that kid from class. Oh, yeah, Patrick. He thinks everything's crazy. When it's not. So let's use his stomach. But, but dude, how are we going to kill him? Uh, ooh, I know. We can, we can put one of my toys on the roof and ask him to go get it. They really about to kill him? You can't just take him and bring him to the doctor. And then we lock him on the roof, and the only way he can get down is jump off. And that's how he dies. Ooh, you evil genius, you. So I bet he's outside. Let's go get him. Yeah, let's get him. 
Uh, hey, Patrick. Hey, guys, look at my Spider-Man bounty. Sure is bouncy. Yeah. Uh, Patrick, we need your help. I lost one of my toys. I need you to get it for me. Okay. Yeah, we need you to use your Spider-Man powers. Okay, I help. Uh, come on. See, Patrick, right there. there. There's my paddle ball right there. Why is it on the roof? Uh, I got frustrated because I couldn't do it, and it was making me mad, so I threw it on the roof. Oh, that makes sense. Can you go get it for me? Okay, this is crazy. Joseph, close the window, close the window. I got you, dude. Uh! Why did they close the window? They about to, they about to hope he fall, huh? I'm gonna get the paddle ball. Wee, this is fun. So now what, dude? Well, uh, eventually he's gonna get hungry and he's gonna wanna get off the roof and we locked the window, so the only way for him to get off the roof is he has to jump and jumping off the roof will kill him. Okay, so when is that gonna happen? Uh, well, he's having a lot of fun with that paddle ball, so. Yeah. Okay, well, maybe we should go try to kill someone else in case he doesn't jump. Ooh, sounds like fun. All right, <laughs> Joseph, let's think of someone else in case Patrick doesn't jump off the roof. Ooh, how about that bully kid from class that's always bullying us? Oh, yeah, the bully. He's always making fun of us. Wait, why didn't we think of him first? We don't care about him. Right? Y'all could, yeah, y'all could have been thought about the bully. Why y'all gotta... Okay, so, so how about this? We go get the bully to come over to my house. We tell him we want to go swimming, and we say we're stronger swimmers than him. Ooh, that'll make him mad, dude. And the only way he's a stronger swimmer than us is if he can swim with his weight tied to his ankle. And then he'll drown, and then we'll use his stomach, and we can let Patrick off the roof. Ooh, that's a genius plan! We take a life and save a life! Yeah, so, so let's go get the bully. Yeah, let's get his bully. <laughs> Nerd, give me your lunch money. I don't have any money. I know you do. Hey, bully. Oh, yeah, and he got thick. Look at him. Look, evil. What, what do you nerds want? Give me your lunch money. Uh, we, we were gonna invite you to swim in my pool. W why would you invite me? You guys hate me. Uh, but you're our best friend. Yeah, and wouldn't you like to swim in a nice, cool pool? You look stressed. Yeah, that sounds kind of fun, actually. Yes, yeah, so, so come swim in my pool with us. Okay. All right, let's swim in the pool. Yeah! Wow, I never thought you guys would let me swim with you. That's really nice. Thank you. You don't know how to swim! Pussy! What? Yeah, you suck at Look at him. Look at, look at, he, th he thought they was actually being nice. Swim it! Ooh, you're gonna drown! Well, I can swim! Someone who doesn't know how to swim says what? What? You can swim! I can swim! I, I, I can swim! If you're so good at swimming, <laughs> then I bet you can't swim with this weight tied around your ankle. Well, I bet I can! Okay, let's tie it on your ankle then, come okay. on! Ah, uh, okay. he gonna do it too, dummy. You sure you can swim with this weight tied to your ankle? Yeah, I'm a really strong swimmer. Ha, you're gonna swim to the bottom! Alright, Joseph, throw the weight in there. <laughs> 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 We're about to get a stomach. Oh, yeah. Stomach us up, dude. Uh, all right, Patrick, you can come down now. Hey, guys. You kind of left me on the roof up here. Mm, 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 mm. They laughing because they say, oh, look at him drown. How is that funny? Yeah, sorry about that, but we don't need you anymore, so you can jump off now. Okay. Hey, can I jump in your pool from here? Uh, jump into the pool? Uh, Yeah, you should be able to make it in the pool from right there. Okay. Crazy. Whoa! <laughs> what? Patrick, what'd you do? Yeah, dude, he's supposed to be drowning. Guys, the crazy what? thing just happened. I jumped off the roof and I saw this guy drowning and I saved his life. What? We were trying to kill you guys. Yeah, you ruined uh, uh, Then he just told on him. Really? What? what? I'm out of here. Whoa, Patrick, you ruined everything. You want what? me to get back on the roof? Yeah, get back on the roof. Hurry okay. up. <sighs> Patrick's so clueless. He he's to go say, you want me to get back on the roof? You Did you not just hear them say that they were just trying to kill you guys? I'm so frustrated. I know. We had him, dude. He was drowning. I know, and then Patrick had to save his life. <sighs> but at least Patrick's back on the roof. But he can keep jumping in the pool, dude. Okay, how about we drain the pool so when he jumps in the pool, he dies? But it's going to take hours to drain the pool. Okay, how about while the pool drains, we get another person to come over and we get their stomach? Like who, dude? Oh, we can call it Penelope. But don't you have a crush on her? But she's a girl, and all girls are the same. It's not like I'm a... Wow. He got a crush on Penelope, but he don't care about Penelope. <laughs> I miss her. You're right, dude. Juice World was right. Yeah, all girls are the same. So I'll call up Penelope and just ask her for her stomach. Wait, why would she give you her stomach, though? Because girls want to be skinny, and if she gives us her stomach, she'll be skinny. Oh, yeah, she would totally be skinny. Okay, yeah, because she won't eat anymore. So let me call Penelope. What do you want, Junior? Well, there's something I need from you. Ooh, I like how this starts off, dude. Okay, well, what do you need? Well, the thing I need is inside of you. Oh, no, I'm out of here. No, 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 no I, promise, I promise I'm not being gross. I'm not. Listen, the thing I need is where babies come from. Oh, my God, I'm leaving! I'm talking about your stomach. I'm talking about your stomach. Where babies don't come from your stomach, Junior? Yes, they do. That's why women's stomach get big when they're pregnant. Come from your stomach. Ugh, I don't have time to explain anatomy to you. Okay, listen, we need your stomach. It's an emergency. Well, why? Because Cody needs a stomach transplant or he's going to die. No, Junior. If I give you my stomach, I'll die. Well, listen, listen, baby. Listen, talk to me. Talk to me, baby. Listen. Don't you want to be skinny? Hey, if you yeah. give me your stomach, you're not going to eat anymore and you'll actually be skinny. Yeah, you look pretty fat over there, Penelope. You look like a you chunky baby. Monkey. Excuse me? Look, you're gaining a few pounds. Listen, you're, you're pretty big. Why are they discouraging her like that? 
big. You're bigger than me. So listen, if you give me your stomach, you'll lose weight because you won't eat, and then you'll be like a supermodel. Paper thin. Yeah, guys will actually like you. You know what? I'm fine with the way <laughs> I look, Junior. Okay, you can lie to yourself, but not me. Listen, you get you get skinny, but we can we can fix your face later with plastic surgery. Yeah. But listen, you give me your stomach, you'll be really skinny. I promise. Fix your face later with plastic surgery. If you have a crush on her, Junior, why are you talking about her face like that? I thought you thought it was cute. Promise. Oh my God, you are so rude, Junior. I'm leaving. No, 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 I wish a stomach would just fall into our laps. <gasps> Who, who's at the door? I don't know. Hello? Hey, uh, you mind if I hide out here for a while? The police are looking for me. What'd you do? Oh, they, uh, they about to think about taking his stomach. Look at him. He looks crazy. He just got out of jail. Probably. He looked like it. Nothing serious. I uh, stole a video game. Well, that's dumb. Video games should be free. Yeah. Y yeah, yeah. That's, that's what I said. Yeah, so you can come inside. Yeah, you look cool, dude. Oh, good. Okay. So, why you just invite a crazy stranger that's getting chased by the police into your home? What's your name? Uh, Purple People Eater. Purple People Eater? Yeah, but you can call me Greg. All right, Greg, what do you want to do? Uh, I'm hungry. People oh, Eater. The news is on. I wouldn't watch that. Breaking news. Because he's on the news. I'm dead. News. The normal news anchor is on a cruise. So, filling in is me, Steve Stalberger. So, breaking news! An escaped convict known as the Purple People Eater, known for eating his victims after they've decomposed and turned purple, has escaped from prison. Ew, that's disgusting. Keep an eye out for him. He's very dangerous. Awkward. Uh, Greg? Can yeah, you awkward. Okay. Uh, Joseph, there's a serial killer right next to us. You know what that means? We need to run. What? No, 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 no. Grab the hammer and kill him. We can take his stomach. No one's going to miss a serial killer. Oh, you're right, dude. I'll get the hammer. All right. Hey, Greg. So we don't care what we just saw on the news. I mean, we know you're a good guy. Yeah, I only stole a video game. I got the hammer, dude. Wait, what's the hammer for? Uh, we're going to make a TikTok to that song, Hammer Time. Uh, I love that song. Yeah, so go, go, go. Ah! <laughs> well, kid, your friend. They killed him. Wow. Friends never came back. I guess I'm just gonna have to pull the plug. Uh, doctor, doctor, doctor! I found a guy we can take his stomach. What is that? Purple people eater? Yeah, we hit him with a hammer. What? You know he eats people, right? His stomach is gonna be full of human remains. Well, you can just empty the stomach. Yeah. Uh, yeah. When you think about it, yeah. He, no, don't give, don't give your friend that stomach. I mean, give it to him. It's still a stomach. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay, I guess we can do the surgery after all. Yeah! Well, guys, I made a full recovery. I just want to say thanks for giving me a new stomach. Anytime, bud! Uh, get, get back down here. Yeah, Cody. Stomach probably not even healthy from the dude that be eating people. That's disgusting. We wanted you to be alive, so we got you a stomach. There was a lot of people we tried to kill. Wait, what? Yeah, there was a lot of people. We had to find you a new stomach, and we finally got you the perfect stomach. So how's it feeling? Well, it's okay, but whenever I eat food, I just don't feel satisfied. Oh, uh, well, maybe because you need to eat people. Wait, what? Yeah, that stomach belonged to a serial killer who ate people. Wait, what? He ate people? Yeah, but only... So he don't feel satisfied. He feel weird. Oh, my gosh. Purple people, which means after the body decomposed and turned purple. Oh, oh God, I think I'm going to throw up. Well, no, you're not. Your stomach's used to eating stuff like that. So oh. look, maybe it's just hungry because you're not eating people. Uh, I can't eat people, Junior. Yeah, well, don't worry. You don't have to eat people, but that's probably why you're not satisfied. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. I don't, I don't have to. Wow, Cody started eating his friend. But thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be reacting to more videos, and I'm out.